sick prison plan, romp twist and devastating exit. As a murderer continues to manipulate behind bars, two relationships are on the rocks in Emmerdale, as deception is exposed a murderer is behind bars, but her manipulation continues to infect those around her. But will they bend to her will, or will she be the one to snap? Meanwhile, another mystery person's true identity could break apart a rock-solid relationship in Emmerdale. Yet, as anger gets the better of one, the other is hellbent on making things right between them again. Or will it just make everything worse? Elsewhere, one villager looks set to say goodbye to her home for good. Here's what's coming up on Emmerdale next week Evil Mina targets Charles from prison Evil serial killer Mina Jutla will try to manipulate the village residents from prison. Charles has made it his plan to crack Mina's confession as she awaits her plea hearing, but fresh from a string of police interviews over her involvement in the deaths of Leanna Kavanagh, Ben Tucker and Andrea Tate, Mina still wants things her way. Charles will end up visiting Mina in prison as he tries to get a confession out of her. Image. ITV, ITV, however, he is taken aback when Mina confesses to killing Andrea and spills every little painful detail about what happened during that fateful day in the maze maze. Charles struggles to cope as Mina tells him all about what happened, and he soon returns back to church as he tries to process what she said. With a few supportive words from Harriet, he decides it would be good to set up a support group to help those who have been struggling, following the deaths of so many villagers at the hands of the evil killer. Image. ITV, ITV, he is encouraged when Dr. Liam Kavanaugh who lost his daughter Liana and whose wife Layla was shot by Mina in the terrifying showdown on the viaduct last week, agrees to join and get involved. The following day, Charles tells Mina over the phone that he doesn't want to see her again for now and decides to put his congregation first and spend his time with them. Mina is fuming and slams the phone receiver against the prison wall, her plan to manipulate Charles instantly foiled. But will Mina find a new way to get to him? Or how will the support group feel when they find out Charles has been visiting her in prison? Marcus risks tearing apart Marlon and Rona Marlon Dingle and Rona Gozgirk could find their relationship on the rocks, thanks to newcomer Marcus Dean. Things will become complicated when Marcus informs Rona, Zoe Henry, that she's been named in Pierce Harris's will. Rona knows that time is running out to tell Marlon, Mark Charnock, the truth about Marcus's identity, but when she learns about the will, she's not sure what to do. When Kim Tate, Claire King, stops by to speak with Rona and learns of Marcus's identity, she's left rattled, but Rona does her best to explain everything about Pierce and Marcus, Darcy Gray. Image. ITV, ITV, however, Kim can't believe what she's hearing, and as she storms out, Marlon enters looking confused, as he's only caught the tail end of the confrontation. Rona finally comes clean to a stunned Marlon but he decides to leave as he needs time to digest everything that he's just been this told. leaves Rona devastated Rona and fearing the worst for the future of their relationship. Image. ITV, ITV, the following day Marlon tells Patty that he's unsure if he'll ever be able to forgive Rona, and when they cross paths, there's a war of words. When Rona insults Marlon's ego and accuses him of victim shaming her, Marlon's left visibly hurt. Overseeing it all, Marcus pleads with him to not take his anger over Pierce out on Rona, and Marlon is struck deep by Marcus's words. But will it be enough for Marlon to want to reconcile? Rona is hellbent on making things right between her and Marlon, and decides to propose to him, but what will his answer be? Ethan attempts to change Marcus's plans and unexpected romance twist Ethan Anderson will try to convince Marcus to stay in the village as he's developed feelings for him. After Pierce Harris's will reading, Marcus sees no point in hanging around the village any longer and makes plans to move on. Regretful, Ethan, Emil John, suggests a meet-up before Marcus leaves, but unfortunately Marcus rejects the offer. Ethan later attempts to secure another date with Marcus, but his efforts continue to fall flat. Image. ITV, ITV, the next day, Ethan's encouraged when Rona Gozkirk and Marlon Dingle both give him their approval in pursuing a relationship with Marcus. Will he be able to get Marcus to change his mind before he turns his back on the village for good? Earlier this month, Marcus actor Darcy Gray appeared on ITV's Lorraine, where he teased that there's more to Marcus than meets the eye. Marcus is the son of the late Pierce, who is Rona's abusive ex-husband, and was the one who broke the news to her of his death at the beginning of February. Image. ITV, ITV, speaking to Lorraine Kelly, 30-year-old Darcy said of his character. It's one of those things where it's such a strong storyline to come into, so you've got to be very careful treading those sorts of waters. We'll definitely find out a bit more about who he is. 
I think that's the really lovely thing about Marcus, he's coming in with this presumption of who he is, but only time will tell exactly who that person actually is, Darcy teased. So if his comments are anything to go by, it seems there's more drama ahead, and Marcus might not be leaving the village so soon. Laurel's exit twist is Jai forced to make life-changing decision Laurel Thomas is set for another shock on the soap next week, amid the ongoing fallout from partner recent Jai Sharma's fraud. The drama began when Laurel, Charlotte Bellamy, tried to apply for a mortgage in order to buy Mulberry Cottage, unaware that Jai, Chris Bisson, had taken out a fraudulent loan in her name amid his ongoing financial woes. He tried to stall her to hide the truth, but the web of lies unraveled when she applied for the loan anyway, and her application was rejected straight away. Image. ITV, ITV, Jai was then forced into admitting the truth of what he had done when Laurel almost went to the police. ITV spoilers now revealed that their housing situation could now result in Laurel being forced to leave the Dales. The drama kicks off next week, when Laurel fights tears as she realizes that she's going to have to look outside the village in order to find a place within her price range. Image. ITV, ITV, this situation goes from bad to worse when Kim then informs devastated Laurel that she's found a buyer for Mulberry in later scenes. The soap's master manipulator tells an emotional Laurel that she has 40 days to vacate the property. But Jai is then put in the position of facing a life-changing choice on the soap when Kim approaches him with a proposition. In later scenes, Kim asks Jai for his shares in the Hawksford Outdoor Pursuits Center, saying that in return, she will give him enough money to pay off his loan and put a deposit on Mulberry. What will Jai decide to do? Could this be the last we see of Laurel in the village? Emmerdale airs weekdays at 7 p.m. on ITV.